Yo, yo, yo. Hello. Yo. Hello, everybody. Hi. Why is it saying things? Oh, I need to... <laughs> I need to switch something. I'm trying to think why that's happening. Well, I think I know why that's happening. No, I have no idea why that's happening. <clears throat> My clip has 3,000 views? Which clip was it? Was it the one from last night? The hero one? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, dude. That was such a funny clip. Very funny clip. I am literally flooding my lungs. Oh wait, what the hell, dude? That wasn't- Oh my god, I thought that was chat. I thought that was the widget talking. When it said yo and hi earlier. That was people subbing. Oh my god. Watu, thank you, dude. And thank you, Selforo and CEO of Lung Failure. And Cozy Boy thinks, guys. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I was like, where is that text-to-speech coming from? <clears throat> Jew. Mouthwash, thank you, dude. Appreciate it. What's happening today? Uh, I'm pretty tired today, so I'm probably just gonna goof around and stream these. You guys remember that neat game that I played the other day where you're like in the house with your grandpa and you're just throwing up everywhere and falling and busting your ass? I'm gonna try some of the games by that dev. I don't know what they're gonna be like, but we will we'll rapid fire test them and we'll see how it goes. <clears throat> Those games were so funny. Or, or that game, Starbo rather. Black. Thank you, Finite Immortal. Appreciate it, dude. Twelve times four right now? What does that mean? You're asking me a math question? Why? I like how the, I like how there's seven different numbers. Will you stream quote unquote normally tomorrow? What does that mean? <laughs> what do you mean normally? Like at a normal time or? I don't know what that means. Thank you, Esme Shroom. I appreciate it. No, I'm normal. I'm very normal. I woke up super early today, guys. I, this is the earliest I've woken up in a while. I woke up at 9 a.m. I know, I know, it's crazy. <laughs> Thank you, C Doggo. Appreciate it, dude. I 
I'll be right back. I have to uh, shut my blinds because I don't want people looking in at me. I'm back. It's classic skinwalker behavior. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm always worried someone's gonna come in here and like, or not come in here, but they're gonna like drop a package off at my door or something and they're gonna look in and see me. Which is not ideal. <clears throat> Thank you, Fox Tart. Skinwalker stream LFG. Appreciate it. They'll be like, oh no, a guy in his computer? <laughs> no, no, I'm like obviously streaming. I don't want people to, dude, I've got like a big green screen behind me. I've got like, I don't want people to see this. This is shameful. This is, yeah, I can't see, I can't be seen. <clears throat> Why is Charborg shy? Dude, I j listen. I <laughs> I'm not shy. I just don't want people to see me or look at me or talk to me or say anything to me. That's not being shy. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I don't want... Dude, some kid looked through my window before. I told you guys that like forever ago, but I was like sitting here and I just looked over and some kid walked up and put his eye, like his, uh, his hands around his eyes and like went up to my window and looked in and I was like, what the hell? It was so weird. Did you wave? No, I just looked at him and he ran off. It was strange. <clears throat> yeah, like, I, dude, I felt like a gorilla at the zoo. He's gonna remember that? I'm sure he will. Saw some weirdo, like, sitting at his desk. No, you know what? I take that back. Saw this normal person behaving normally. And he was the weird one. Thank you, Nanu, for the prime. Appreciate it. He starts tapping the glass and I start freaking out. Yeah. <laughs> He's got, you know, those little, like, uh, it's like a gumball machine, but you put it in and you twist it and then, uh, like, duck food comes out. Like little fish pellets. He throws that at it and I start picking them up. Mmm. Someone was at your window? No, Plum, this was a long time ago. Some kid, like, came up and looked in the window. What if he's watching right now? Well, the blinds are closed now. I'm not scared of that kid anymore at the moment. I'm not scared of him anymore right now. <laughs> Thank you, Rydoge. Or Rido? Rido? No, Rydoge. Thanks, dude. And Kia, thank you for the reset. How the freak has it been 31 months? What's happening? Oh, God. Time. Time is freaky. Yeah, I, dude, I should start charging people. Five bucks, and you can come look it through my window and, like, watch me. I'd make a killing. Oh, you're right. That's like streaming already. You're right. 
Well, no, this is like in a more a more of a zoo setting. I'm th I'm like imagining a habitat. Like they peer through, and I've got, you know, a granola bar that I'm chewing on, and I'm kind of like staring aimlessly at stuff or you know, like wasting time. No, I didn't tell everyone about Scampy, guys. The Scampy arc has concluded. If you didn't know, Scampy is the stray cat that we were going to take in to uh, get fixed. Well, she had babies, and we took in her and three babies. And it was supposed to be a quick little, you know, deal with this and then move on with our lives. But she stayed with us for, like, over two months. And, and it was very hectic and stressful. The kittens have been sent out and they are getting homes they've been renamed that we were calling them uh we were calling them slim chunky and angel but now they're like they've been renamed to like christmas shit dude they're like t there's t they're in tinsel uh what was it plum actually I, I don't know no there was like gingerbread something but uh yeah, and uh, Scampy, we got her fixed. She got taken care of. And we released her, and we were like, well, there she goes. Uh, we'll never see her again because we betrayed her trust and everything. She ran off. She's a free cat. And then she came back and sat outside our door and meowed, and we fed her. Don't get it twisted, though, guys. She hates our ass. She hates us. Like, the dude, for two months, we would feed her every single day and interact with her. We would come in the room, and she would just hiss like crazy at us. She hated our ass. Our collective asses. But, yeah. Um, no, she knows we've got food. And she, knows, she remembers how warm it was in this house. Now she's outside and she's like, damn, this kind of sucks. How is Minnie Gilbert? Minnie Gilbert's wonderful. Is she feral? Yeah, dude, she's feral as fuck. Not Minnie Gilbert. Scampy. Scampy, dude, she is ridiculous. That's why we released her back out, like, into the, uh, into the wild. She's just nervous? I don't think I don't think so. She's ridiculous, that cat. No, it's normal. Some cats just like that. I think I think what we're describing here is a feral cat. Scampy was absolutely feral, dude. She was ridiculous. I mean, no, I mean, nothing against her. I love the little, the little critter, but she was feral as fuck. Uh, PB and J, dude, thank you for the gifted subs. Yeah, I, dude, two months of trying to like, she came back. There's enough proof. I think she just knows that we've got food. I mean, yeah, I'm sure we could domesticate her and get her, like, one day to where she could live in our household, but, dude... Uh, hey. Is your bathroom all torn up? Eat to shreds. Just give her time to get used to, to her even more? Give her time to get used to us? No. You guys, Scampy, Scampy will, uh, remain outside. She's an outside cat. I don't think there's any... We don't got room... We don't got room for Scampy, and we don't got the time to train this little beast. So yeah, she lives in the area, and we feed her in the evenings. That's how it will remain. <clears throat> I believe. Yeah, we. I mean, we could touch her on occasion, like... When she was eating, or not eating, but like just sitting there, sometimes we could get close enough and like touch her, but then she would not really like it at all. 
But I'm glad it all worked out, because that was a stressful couple months. Make her in a little outdoor shelter? Yeah, we. I put a box out there with the blankets, and uh, she wasn't really too interested in going inside, but she did smell it once. <clears throat> So hopefully she, yeah, that, I mean, she, before we collected her, she came up every single night and we fed her. And then just now, or just last night, you know, her coming up again. I think things are going to return back to normal. Yeah, it'd be so nice to give her a little heating pad. All right. Anyway, guys, um, so today I'm just going to try a few random games. I don't know if they're going to be that fun. But they're, uh, the ones that I'm going to try are by that dev who made Neat that I played the other day where you have your grandpa in your house and it's Halloween and you're vomiting and slipping and falling. I'm going to try some of their other games. The Thank first one, out for the very one uh, appropriate name, Cat Lady Simulator, I think is what we're going to try first. Thank you, Big Wet Mine. Thanks for the resub. Cat Lady Simulator. Like I said, I I have not tested these games. I don't know if they're going to be fun. The only reason I played that previous one called Neat is because I saw Buck streaming it and he looked... Or it looked very fun. We're going into uncharted territory here. This could be awesome. And look, I even have a little thing like this. Current game, Cat Lady Simulator. So people don't come in and say, what the hell is this? <clears throat> All right, um, is it this? You hear him? That one's climbing the damn wall. So thus far, my experience with this game <laughs> is I launched it to make sure that it ran, which it did, and then I closed it. Uh, now, guys, we are trudging forward into uncharted territory. I saw that. I saw that. No, you can't. What the hell? Blake. Generation Zero. Wait, am I going to be breeding cats? Oh, look how cute this cat is. Come here, Flake. Wait. Whoa! What's this? Whoa! All right, anyway, let's figure out what the hell to do. Who is this? Oh, that's Flake. Wait, wait, I thought there was another cat. Am I crazy? Whoa, chill, Flake. Maybe he's playing in this little cat room. The cat food? Yeah, the, the cat food is the same as that, uh, <laughs> that neat game that I played. It's just sort of like the, the meat log. All right, let's uh, check. How do I get on the seat? Push on every button on my keyboard. Maybe you don't sit in there. Maybe I just look at it from afar. Buy cats! Oh my god! Whoa, we can buy cats! I gotta sit down. There's definitely a. C X C Control Alt Shift Caps Lock Tab. Z, X, C, V, B, N, M, A, S, D, F, G, H, J, K, L. Alright, I, I must I must have hit the blow up and buy something button. I don't know what exactly happened there. Whoa, my, did you see that? What did I hit? What was the last thing I said? I think, yeah, I'm, 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 like an artillery shell hit my home. L? All right, I pushed L again and nothing happened. Q W E R T Y. Oh wait, I'm not even looking at the chair. Okay, nothing. K? Was it K? Let me check. J. H. G. F. Oh! What a! 
Okay, something mysterious is happening. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> what? <laughs> this is like a bizarre experience. Let me try this again. F, maybe? F. I just pushed F. It seems like maybe there's a delay. <laughs> G. Okay, it's G. G is doing something. What is it, though? G. G for grenade? It has a grenade button? I don't understand. Wait, who's this other cat? Marty. Ugh. Marty, hey! Do you live here? <laughs> You're not some stranger cat, are you? You live here, right? Here, you can go back to eating. <laughs> Enjoy your dinner, Marty. Alright, so G is like the blow up and cash register noise. Button. Let's see if we can continue to figure out how to sit down in the chair. And guys, there's no like escape button or uh, anything like that. Wah! All right, you push you push E on the computer to sit down. All right, we've got how much money? 150 bucks. Want to be luck? Yes. Oh, Einstein, she's cute. El Barto, that's the most terrifying cat I've ever seen. We don't have the cash for this though. We've got 150. Um, ew, Jordan. 103, we can buy this. Mini, mini master, mini master mail. One sec, how do I get out? Mini master. Mini master, dude, he's fast as hell. Welcome to the family, Mini Master. They got Greasy Cat in there? We'll have to watch the, uh, the computer, see if Greasy Cat shows up. Pepsi, bitch. Wait, is this copyright? Is this copyrighted? Is that gonna get me banned? Ooh, probably not gonna do that. Um, I mean, the vibes were immaculate, but I don't want to get banned off Twitch. I'm still so paranoid. After Buck, a couple years ago, Buck got quote unquote like perma banned from Twitch because they copyright they grabbed his uh, all his vods that had copyrighted music all at once and striked him out of the planet and then we we all like tagged Twitch and stuff and I think they might have seen that and revoked it but I'm scared no he's back hey don't worry he's back um okay so guys I think we get Marty and Flake to maybe have a baby cat let me see if I can't figure that out Oh, they're drinking. Wait, oh, that's so cute. They need wet? Wait, you're right. They're probably thirsty. Um. Alright, well, where would I get some water? Buy wet? So, wait, you think wet? Wait, you think wet is water? I thought wet was gonna be wet food. Wait. Oh my god, it is. It's water. I thought wet meant wet food. Okay. Well, they've got a bowl full of wet. Uh, let's hope... <laughs> These cats, like, sprinting around, dude. Alright, let's see if we can figure out how to make some cash. What is this? Maybe I put a cat in here to, like... Oh? Is this a cannon? Wait, who was that? I just... Marty... Do we still have Mr. Master? Who was? Guys, we just launched Flake, I think. Um, well, did it? Uh, did I get paid? Okay, Flake was worth like a few bucks, like fifty bucks maybe. You sold Flake, <laughs> dude. I... 
I think I launched him very far through a cannon. And then somebody might have seen that and then transferred me 50 bucks to my PayPal because they thought it was cool. She's back? What? Wait, wait. Did you lie to me? You think that's funny? Oh, she's on the PC? Wait, they kill them? They kill the cats? I love you, Sharkuduria. Oh my god. Four seconds before kill. Well, that's sad. I, I want to have every single one of them. Start breeding? Okay, well, let's figure out how. Guys. Okay, we've got male and female cat. How do we get them to, like, maybe all the. <laughs> how do we get them to, like, have a baby? Yeah, let's put them in here. Come on. Okay. And now, Mr. Master. Come on, little dude. So now maybe a baby will pop out of here. Okay, come on. Who is this, Marty? Marty, get down in there. Oh my god! Alright, Marty, Mini Master, and Einstein. Ladies and gentlemen, say hello to Einstein, our newest cat. Real precious. Um, yo guys, you wanna have another? I don't quite know how to- maybe you can't pick them up when they're hungry, or when they're eating. Mr. Master, come on, we need your services- wait. Okay. Okay, let's get another one out here. Okay, who we got? Where do you go? Einstein, Marty, Einstein. Wait, that one. Hey, are you the second Einstein or are you the OG? Oh damn, Marty's getting thirsty and he's also getting crazy with it. Whoa, hey Einstein, do not bump into your brother. Um, okay, let's get some water. Buy, let's buy some wet. Get these cats, uh, drink. Oh, it looks like they're kind of hungry, too. I wish I could figure out how to get this cat food out of here. Hey, Marty, come on, get off the food. You're pissing everyone off. Did, please tell me that one did not just die. Okay, he's asleep. <laughs> Dude, Mr. I thought Mr. Master just kicked the bucket. Oh, he's good. All right, um... Ugh, look, they're drinking this wet like crazy. I wish I could speed... Or I wish I could slow down their thirst. Um, okay, who should I sell? Because we do have to sell these cats to make money. Guys, should we sell Einstein's? I think we st we sell the Einstein brothers. Get rid of them. Not because I dislike them or anything, just because I think it's their time. All right, Einstein. No, Einstein, you're making this harder than it needs to be. Come on, you can listen. You can. There's a bunch of food up in there. <laughs> Do the kittens have better stats? Yeah, they do. Wait, maybe I should sell the OGs and then I should make the Einsteins mate. Wait, do we got a, a boy and a girl Einstein? We do, okay. I'll sell the uh, the original cats. Come on, guy. Okay, Marty. Marty, thank you so much for being such a wonderful cat in this family. We love you and we will miss you. Come on, what are you doing? Get up there. There we go. 
Let's see how much cash that made us. Whoa! Holy smokes! All right. Wait. Um. Real quick. Got you guys. Remember before I figured out there was a cannon mechanic, I was hearing that explosion by pressing what button? What button was that? G. Okay, so, did that give me money? No? Okay. Alright, let's get, uh, oh, they're out of wet, again, dude. Again with these cats. Alright, uh, we can't waste any more time. Mr. Master, come on, sweet cat. Get out! How much money we got from that? We didn't even make back the wet. Mr. Master was worth less than wet. Okay. Whoa, wait, hey, buddy. All right, Einstein. We are gonna make an Einstein amalgamation. No, Einstein, get in here. Einstein with Einstein. Come here, you. <laughs> Come here. And Einstein. Let's see what happens. We've got, oh Jesus. Einstein, Einstein, and Biff. Welcome to the family, Biff. No, guys, here's a question. Should we double Biff? Should we get two Biffs and make a double Biff? I think we'll combine the Einsteins once more. These guys look like little hash browns flying around the room. <laughs> They're very precious, aren't they? So, does this confirmed make a uh, Einstein? Andre. Okay, so we just got lucky by getting two Einsteins. Oh, they're immediately going to town on this food. Should we, you say, buy a Biff? You think we should do that? Let's see if we can spot a Biff in here. Peanut. Oh, Peanut, you're so cute. Goodbye, though. Sorry you died. Paw boy! Uh! Biff is what, 1158? Dude! Cool cat. Oh, and there's there's mini master, the little bastard, worth fucking nothing. Um, okay, where, where who do we just get? Paw boy, guys. I say we do Biff and Paw boy. I think this is gonna really work out for us. Come on, Paw boy. Come on. Okay, Paw boy, and where's Biff at? The little creature. That math is hard. Yeah, I'm not too great. <laughs> Wait, where's Biff? Come here. Thank you guys for the subs, everyone. Biff. Can you get out here, Biff? Oh, they need more wet. Let me get them some. They're scared of me? Oh, come on. No, they're not. They love this household. I think they're just playing back there. There we go, Biff. Okay, come on, Biff. Oh, Biff's a boy cat. Okay, come on, Biff. Get back out of here. Come on. All right, who do we, geez Louise. Who do we pair with, uh, who's in there? We'll, we'll throw an Einstein in. All right, we've got Paw Boy with an Einstein. Let's see what happens. Which gives us a uh, who was it? We got a Tyrone. 
Is this him? Oh my goodness, hello! <laughs> She's so cute. They all look really similar though, huh? Cats. God, but I love them all so really much. We. Oui. I better get him some more food. The food's a hundred. All right, listen. Here's what I say we do. We've established that. What was that one that was worth like fifteen hundred bucks? Do they need to eat? Maybe not. Tasty. Biff. Biff was expensive. All right, Biff. We're gonna sell you, Biff. Oh, they're out of wet. Jeez, these cats. All right, Biff. Biff, please. Sometimes they just don't pick up. I think it's when they're eating. Okay. All right, let's sell a Biff and see how much we get for that. That was like a $900 cat. Guys, write that down in your little uh, little notepads. If we see a Biff, we've got to sell. There's just no way around it. A Biff is... Big bucks. I think it's based on size slash age. So wait, you're telling me Paw Boy would sell for a lot? One minute, let's get Paw Boy out there. 1167. Wait, why did it not sell? Paw boy! Get your little cat ass up there. Jesus! You're right, dude! I think the older and like stat filled these cats are, the more money they're worth. Dude, we could pro I say we invest into a big cat. And then we breed them. Hi, Einstein. Yeah, you're right. I think it is stat-based. You're right. That makes the most sense. Ho! Oh, oh. Ho! I don't know what they were even called. I just impulse bought them. Who was this? Meowster, dude! Alright, Meowster, you're going straight into the uh, tube. This cat, look at this. I don't know what the S stat is. Maybe that's... Uh... <laughs> I don't know what that stands for. Speed, maybe? Yeah, speed. Probably. Alright, come on. Stupid barf and fast. <laughs> uh, what's, uh, who, who is this? Einstein. Alright, we'll throw an Einstein in. Alright, let's see what we get. What? Oh, dude, oh, she's tuckered out. I, I thought that was a death. It turns out she's just tired. Okay, um, who did we just get? Was it Palmaster? Did we just get Palmaster? Okay, Palmaster's got some pretty good, uh, stupid. What, what, what did we say this stat was? I'm gonna sell them and see how much it's worth. I didn't catch it. All right, we got to get rid of some of these cats. Uh, they're go they're going through the wet too fast. Um, you? No, I love Einstein. I just there's so many goddamn. Dude, Tyrone, look at the what's the F stand for? I don't remember. All right, we're gonna sell the Einsteins. Yo. buy more water yeah I mean wet my bad you're right all right you come on Tyrone you've been a wonderful little cat 
Goodbye, though. Alright, I'm getting us down to two cats so I can focus. He's gonna- this is gonna be our money-making cats. Cause look at this. 66F on Tyrone, Meowster's got 59S. No clue what that means, but the higher those are, the better we do. Strength, beauty, and fertility. Wait, is it? No, that's wrong, because they would all be, like, maxed out on the- on beauty. It can't possibly be that. Let's see how much money we've got. 1226. What this ad is for be want to be luck. Uh, it says so on the itch.io page. Wait, it's it is. <laughs> Click the ad. I tried. Maybe I should push E on it. No. Hi, Jebediah. Okay. Meowster and Tyrone. Alright, let's throw them in the pot. Twelve months? That has to be at least one year. Thanks, dude. Thanks, everybody. I got behind, but I appreciate it. Did that count? Alright, and that gave birth to another Biff, but what about the stats? We gotta see those stats. Alright. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. See how much money we've got. 1226. Let's see how much a <laughs> let's see how much a uh, a little simple Biff sells for. Biff! <laughs> Biff, go! Okay, help me remember 1226. I'm gonna go adjust Biff. I'm probably gonna miss how much money we made, though. 1226, 1332. So that, that was a $100 Biff. Hmm. They need to grow up first? Okay, okay. That's, that's, okay. You're right, you're right. I'll, uh, let them grow up. Uh, we'll just maintain, we'll make another baby, and then we'll maintain for a little bit. Maybe I should do a few at a time, to be honest with you. Alright, we've got ourselves a... Tyrone, where, who, who, who did we just get? You? Hi, what's your name? Marty. It's a Marty, guys. Alright. I'm gonna have a few of these so that we can uh, stock up on cats. Don't worry, guys. I'll get you some wet in a little bit. Okay, we got a Marty and a, a very sleepy Meowster. I think I'll do one more and then we will start letting these guys grow up. Wait, a peanut? Where did this peanut- did they have twins? Where did this peanut just come from? <gasps> what the hell? Did you see that? <laughs> Dude, he just leapt into there. Okay, well we lost a peanut. We gained and lost a peanut all in the span of a couple seconds. That was so sad. <laughs> I did not do that. That, that guy coasted straight into the cannon. Alright, I'm gonna buy some wet for him. See, I'm worried about them, like, sprinting around so close to the can- See, look at that, he's clipping the bookshelf. What does the ad do at the bottom? I, I don't think you can interact with it. I tried already.
Yeah, they're, 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 they're CS surfing. Coasting around the walls. Oh my god. Meowster, you're standing right in the food. Alright, let's see. I, I say we throw... Who was it that we were... Wait, where did this bill come from? God, I'm getting these cats confused. Alright, I say we throw Tyrone and... Meowster back in? We're gonna have maximum money here in a minute. Once these cats grow up a little. Come on. Alright. Bill, Tyrone, Meowster, and Marty. And Andre. According to the dub page, stats stand for strength, beauty, and fertility. Okay, so that was right. Okay. They're out of, they're out of wet already. The quality is falling on these cats? Wait, are, so are their stats going up? Like, look at Bill here. Strength is 37. Remember that. <laughs> Bill is ugly according to the stats. There's not a cat on this planet that's ugly. I think that, listen, being a 4.3 for beauty, even still, that's like a wonderful cat. You know what I'm saying? I will find you an ugly cat? Not possible. Sell the old cats? Uh, but those, see, the old cats, it's like a car. The second you buy them, it starts depreciating value. Um, so I think I should hang on to them just to keep pumping out, like, the better statted cats. You know what I mean? They might waste away. No, I think they're fine. I think they'll live forever, probably. What if they... Wait, how do you see, like, how old they are? I mean, guys, these cats are showing no signs of, like, illness. I think they're fine. Their generation number? Well, no, that means, that means, uh, generation one means that they're a baby of this generation zero. If there's, if I put two generation ones together like this, you'll have a generation two. Watch. Throw you in here. And then, Andre, come here. Get out from under there, Andre. Andre, get out here! <laughs> okay. No, come on, please. Andre, you're starting to piss me off. Mm. Okay. And we got ourselves a... Oh, little one. Who is this? Larry! It's a Larry. Alright, so he... Larry, oh, well, damn you, Larry. I can't... I really would love to check your stats. Hold still. Larry's 41 strength, 45... Uh, F? What was F? I don't remember. Ugh. Uh. Who do we breed to get 
Larry. <laughs> this is too, this is hard. Oh my god, you're right, they're out of wet. Dude, this is what my computer chair needs to look like. I love cats. They're out of food, too. Who do we sell at this point? Sell the Generation Zero cats? Yeah, they are becoming obsolete. Obsoleter and obsoleter by the day. I'll do that. Meowster, well, let's see how much we've got currently. 1532. Guys, say goodbye to Meowster. Though they are getting fired out of a cannon, they'll be fine. They get fired directly into a uh, into the farm that's across the street, which is super exciting. All right. Bye-bye. How much did I make? That was just like a hundred. All right, Tyrone. Thanks for hanging out. No, Tyrone. All right. Couple hundo. All right. Oh, they're out of wet. Guys, I say I cash out. I think I've seen enough of this game. Hi, Einstein. I say we sell them all and then we go buy like a yacht. Marty, have fun. Bill, see ya. Andre, goodbye, and Larry. Come on, Larry. $3,900. Oh, Billy, Billy's so cute. Another Billy. Sale one dollar off, one percent off. Two. Okay. Buy yourself some wet to celebrate. Yeah, you know what? Job well done. Oh man, I have topped the wet off. This is the most I've ever seen in the wet. I'm gonna, could I buy like multiple of like a cheap cat? Or I think it's just one cat. I gotta find a cheap cat like, okay, we'll buy. Oh, dang it. We get caramel and who? Nugget. Oh, who is this? Did we buy? Th did I buy three caramel? Nugget. Caramel nugget and. Dude, hold still. Okay. Caramel Nugget and where are you? <laughs> nugget, Caramel. Wait for the third. There's two Nuggets! There's two Nuggets!
dupe the purchase? Do you think I did? Now I'm poor? Yeah, but I've got a bunch of cats, which is all I need. Oh, I don't have money for what? Well, that'll probably last them the rest of their lives. Alright, I'm done with this one. This one was cute. There's no, there's no like pause menu, so I'm just gonna Alt F4. That one was called uh, Cat Lady Simulator. Pause menu. That would have been nice. Look at the bottom right of the screen. Wait, what am I looking at? Oh, you were talking to someone else. All right, let's see. One sec, guys, I'm gonna run P. I'll be R, B, R, B, R, B. What up, everyone? I remember as a kid, I threw a chow at the wall until it died, and then I cried for an hour. Wait, what are you talking about? What's a chow? It's this thing from Sonic, uh, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Well, I don't know if it's from other Sonic games. 
All right, let me get this next game. All right, we have... Let's check this one called The Deep. Whenever I would hurt a chow, I would hard turn off my console. <laughs> oh, guys, uh, one sec. Um, that game, Abiotic Factor, the devs made a tweet that they're adding voice chat to the game, proximity voice chat, and they used a bunch of, like, <laughs> people complaining about there not being proximity voice chat in the tweet, and I'm on there. They used, there's audio of me being like, yeah, I just really wish it was proximity voice chat. And then another one like, oh, I wish it was proximity voice <laughs> Dude, I saw some comment on the, uh, on the VOD channel where <laughs> some dude was like, Yeah, Charborg was being really annoying this stream. All it takes is there not being proximity voice chat in a game for him to cry and complain about it the entire stream. And I was like, damn. He's kind of right. <laughs> All right, next game has been installed. Complaining helps sometimes. Yeah, you know what? I think you're right, because now proximity voice chat's being added to the game. Just, uh, just some, some constructive feedback. <clears throat> Listen, here's well, actually I want proximity voice chat. Yeah, it's global for you. It's not proximity. Is there not local voice? I think there's gonna be in-game oh, voice. Just... I wish it was proximity so bad. Like... <laughs> <laughs> and then it's a clip of some dude running around. Where am I going? Uh, that way? Oh, okay. <laughs> what a whiner! The whining paid off. No, I know you can't see. I Listen, I'm so paranoid about like pulling Twitter up on stream because dude, anytime I open Twitter, they're showing someone like shaking their butthole. Twitter is a dangerous place. I don't see how like I, I see people all the time like opening and browsing Twitter on stream. And I'm like, how do you do that without seeing like porn? Yeah, dude, Kraken's tweets, there's a bot that replies to every one of Kraken's tweets. And it's, he'll be like, tonight playing some Lethal Company with my friends. And then like immediately underneath it, there's like, oh, you know what else is lethal? My pussy. Hey, and then it's like someone just like, <laughs> like, it's like, it's like a video of like some porn bot. It's so crazy, dude. I'm telling you, go right now. Go to any of Kraken's stream announcement tweets and scroll down. <laughs> I'll take show it on stream. No, I think I'd get in trouble. Yeah, there's bots everywhere, dude. It's crazy. <clears throat> What's Lethal Company? A very good game. <laughs> More Barrow Trauma? We actually want to organize a group for that soon. There's been a trader update that allows you to... Uh... Oh, I have cough drops here. There's a trader update that um, I guess changes the way traders work to make it more balanced or something. Sounds like this is just a char algorithm problem. No, it's not. <clears throat> Alright, this next one is called... What is this one called? The Deep. Let's launch this thing.
we are no longer playing Cat Lady Simulator. This is the deep. Um, could my assistant please pull it up on the screen for me? Thank you. All right. Like I said earlier, I'm playing games from the same dev as that neat game that I played the other day where you're vomiting in the house and throwing up and killing your grandpa. It's another one. Don't know what it's about, but we'll find out together. The Iron Lung parody? Well, let's see when this came out. This might not be an Iron Lung parody. Maybe Iron Lung's a parody of this. Copper Lung. <laughs> the Deep came out. I don't know how to even check this. 2018 What? 2015 2015 Guys, I don't think this is an Iron Lung parody I think this is its own beast Alright, what do we got? What, did a bubble just come out of my fucking head right now? Did you see that? I swear a bubble just popped out of me. Hmm. Little snot bubble, yeah. I've been a little stuffy the past few days. Okay, harpoon. Perfect. In case there's any sort of beasts that I need to take care of. I'll put it down for now. Um, ray gun? <laughs> Vacuum cleaner? Not, I don't know. Oh my! I don't, oh, okay, we're, okay. You have to look at things. Um. Whew, very loud. I think I need to. I think I need to change my uh, limiter to be like negative ten. What went beep just now? Y'all heard that, right? I have no clue. Oh, it's a bomb! <laughs> get down, get down! Okay. Couldn't handle the pressure. I, I blew myself up. What is this? <laughs> Fire extinguisher? Or wait, what, what is that? I think that might... Maybe that's... Oh, this is my, like, diamond... Oh, what the heck? Okay, this is all my diving equipment. So wait, do you think I could... You think I could survive the bomb if, uh... If I've got my diving suit on, let's give it a shot. No. Couldn't handle the pressure. Alright, I'm slowly understanding. Why do we even have a bomb? I'm not sure, but uh, I think it'll come in handy. We'll find a use for it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, okay, we got the sp spa Spamo Luncheon Loaf. Oh my god, I'm hungry. This is worth per- Nope! Stop! Turn this off! That will get me banned. I can't have that playing. Copyrighted music. Okay, we got the Spamo loaf. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> All right, I think we're. Ready. I think I understand every control now. Oh, oh. 
there was an employee manual that I just completely skipped over. Okay, WASD, left and right mount buttons. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Shift, crouch, jump. Shoot, flares is T. All right, perfect. Yeah, this is all making sense. What? Um, hatch. This is the hatch, and it is and it's opening lever. Hold onto the U-shaped bar to open it and gain access to the exterior of the ship. Wait, I'm not in my suit. Uh, okay, wait, let me fit. Let me read more about this. Mag hooks, magnetic hooks on the walls. Okay, I already know that. Tab will bring up your equipment hub. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Assignment, retrieve three golden artifacts with the help of your radar. Keep your ship's oxygen to an adequate level by mining and converting devium from smaller rocks. Minimize costs. You were too expensive to replace. Uh -huh. Use your hand to pick up the ship's seat. Okay, that's how you... That's how you drive. Cruise control direction. Cruise control toggle. Whew. Handle with care, do not damage. Wait, that's that thing over here. What is this? Eyes? Okay, I don't see eyes, but I see something swimming right there. Do you see this? Oh, it's a big fish! It's coral? Oh yeah, it's just coral. Don't worry. I think that's just a little bit of coral. Um... I'm not sure what this is. Let me read more about it. Lift the tube and press the button to access the ship's power core. Failure of the core will lead to the release of the scooter and the automated termination of the ship. Push the button. Oh, there we have it, folks. That would be the core. Try not to stand as close as I am. If any of you are planning on uh, approaching the core, be very careful because I'm getting a lethal dose of radiation at the moment. Put that back away. All right, I think we're good to pilot this thing. Let me just uh, let me just begin piloting. Oh, I'm moving. Let me take a seat. All right, the open road. I don't don't think we're moving, are we? Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. Let's go investigate these beasts. I'm gonna shoot him with the flare. Oh god, they look real freaky. Yeah, they're pretty giant. Oh, they're gonna eat my ass! Hey, back up! Back up! Shoot them! Do something! <laughs> no, I mean they're gonna eat... You know what I mean. Scared them off. Ooh, alright. I'm gonna actually go. I'm gonna explore the uh, water. <laughs> what was wrong with me? <laughs> What is this? Shotgun? Let 
Yeah, I got the horrible death ending. I, I, I don't know. I thought you could, like, use this to go underwater, though. Oh, you know what? You only put on the helmet? Wait, did I? <laughs> Am I not wearing this? I think this counts as the whole thing. What the fuck is that? Oh, I'm dying, dude. Oh my god. Okay. Didn't put the oxygen on that time. No! No! Was the hatch obstructed? I don't know. Um. Maybe this? Okay, that looks fine. Okay. I have no clue what happened last time. Oh, I, you know what? I'm going to get some... Uh, <sighs> gotta get a weapon. On the off chance I run into a beast. Uh, yeah, that looks like a weapon. No. Put that back up. Put this up. Put this up. Okay. I'll just use this the handy dandy harpoon. Put it in the gun? Wait, where, which one's the gun? This? Oh, you know what? You're right. Oh, it's like a grappler! Oops. Okay. Let's reload this hush pup. Oops. I think I broke it. <laughs> oh my god, I gotta go swim back and get that. Oh, no, I think I dropped my... Oh my god, I dropped my harpoon! Damn you, harpoon! <laughs> I'm gonna go explore those clams. Yeah, I'm making rookie mistakes, dude. This is embarrassing. Okay, let's go find those clams. Oh look, I see an item! The little critters obtained something. Let's go steal it from them. Okay, that's scary. Just got here. This looks like if N64 had VR. That's exactly what it is. I've hooked the VR uh, up to my... my Nintendo. Oh god. Let me out! Let me out of here! Let me out! Open your mouth! I'm being crushed. Dang it. Alright, clams like to eat. Jot that down in your notes. Is that a big door over there? Damn! Stop! <laughs> uh, I'm getting the hang of it slowly. I couldn't figure out how to turn the bomb off. Wait! Wait! How do I restart? Kill me. I think, look, I think there's a sub or something, a mini sub.
What does this dog thing do? Look. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's saying I'm docked up here. That's saying I'm on the ceiling. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Oh, look, this is cute. I can, like, stand on the ocean floor. Like a kiddie pool, yeah. Can I drive this? Like, wait, watch this. Yeah, look! Okay. Done screwing around. Let's do this. Oh, look! Is that Biff? What was that guy's name from our from the other cat game? I think that might be Biff. <clears throat> Alright. Let me read what the objective is one more time. One more again. Retrieve three golden artifacts with the help of your radar. Let me see if I can recall how the uh, radar works. <clears throat> radar with four modes and upgrade slot at the bottom. Did, what? Tell me you saw that. That said die. This radar is sending me subliminal messages. <laughs> Trying to freak me out. Thirty three hundred sixty thousand MPA? What is MPA? Wait, here's the upgrade for the radar. Okay, we got ourselves an upgrade. Now we can see north's the cardinal directions. How be your day, Captain? Lebon Tutu, dude, thank you for the tier three. I appreciate it. Thanks, everybody. Sorry I got behind. Off-brand Iron Lung. This came out in 2015. Just so everyone's aware. Um, okay. How do I use the radar? <laughs> this seems like a game I'll have to come back to multiple times to understand how it works. <sighs> reading. No, I'm reading and I don't see like, look it says radar. Radar with four modes and upgrade slot at the bottom. It doesn't tell me how to use it. <laughs> it says we're supposed to use the radar to find the thingies. Here, let's just cruise control a bit and see what we can find. Watch this radar. So is it saying I'm getting closer? Is 
Is this miles per hour? Okay, MPA is a pressure thing. <clears throat> what coordinates are you aiming for? Maybe these? Are these my coords? <laughs> huh? What do we hit? Uh! Brace for impact! Something freaky is happening. I think. No, we're fine. I gotta stop this autopilot though. Yikes! I gotta fix that. Fix, damn you, fix! This is not what you want to see 40,000 MPAs under the sea. I think I might have to go out and fix this. I'm gonna try. Let's suit up. Oh damn it! We're just, we're touching the bottom. Stop. Okay. Let's fix this. Uh, what? This broken glass should be an easy fix. I've dealt with this kind of thing before. What is that? There's a couple eyeballs, nothing to be afraid of. No, that's not how this works. Maybe this is like completely busted forever. Yeah, yeah, guys, that might not even be cracked glass. That could just be a bug we hit or something. Can't be certain. All right, throw these back up. Drop this. All right, let's keep uh, exploring this way, perhaps. I'll shoot a flare. Oh, see this big fish over that way. Hmm. Does it say anything in the book about repair? Where's the book? Where's the book? Did the book fall into the ocean? Tell me, the book did not fall into the sea. That's my lifeline. Does this have headlights? Yeah, I just turned them off and forgot. Wait, no, they're on. How am I gonna do anything without the book? Let me eat a snack and think about this. Oh. I mean, we could try to go back for it. No, I have no idea where it's gonna be. Yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll just, I'll figure this out on my own. <clears throat> What's the book ever done for me? Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and turn the oxygen to, uh, The 15 button presses. Alright guys, I think I might be too stupid to play this game. This one's cool though. Let's keep exploring. I really wish I could see over this glass crack. Cherbo boy. This is a tunnel, right? Where'd that tunnel go? 
Oh, there it is. This better not freak me out, that's all I'll say. Coordinates are at the bottom right. Oh, oh, uh-uh. Oh, okay, so wait, there's like, okay, I see, I see. We've got swirly negative six, half-life symbol negative three. Four, negative nine is where we need to go. Boom. Let's scoot this way until we see something. See it change. Whoa. All right, so we need to go this way. Yeah, I played Kerbal Space Program. I like that game. I want to try it again. What's the current deal with Kerbal Space Program 2? Did it suck? I remember hearing kind of briefly about it. Out too early. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. What's that? Oh, nothing to worry about. Alright, we're going for, what is it, uh, 4 and negative 9. <clears throat> Wait, I'm going the wrong direction. Wait, I'm about to hit something, I think. Yeah, rock. Man, I hate this. I'm thinking about restarting. Yeah, I'm gonna restart so my window's fixed. What? Okay, that just completely uh, backspace restarts you at any time. West, West. <laughs> How did I do that last- how did I get it to display those coordinates last time? I, that was just- That was just pure luck that that happened before. Just hit backspace if something scary happens? Oh, I will be. Alright, I'm just gonna remember where it was. It was... <clears throat> 4, negative 9, correct? Four, coming up to four. Hold. Maybe up that way. Okay, we're, huh? we're at four. Now we gotta figure out where negative nine is. I think four might be the east and west. Nope. Oh, what the hell? I'm so confused. Four. I gotta figure out how to change just the half-life symbol. Okay, that's going that way. So I need to go... I think that curly symbol is the north and south, and then the half-life symbol is the east and west. Means I need to go west. No, I've just screwed up. The Disney Y? <laughs> yeah, we got the Disney Y and the Half-Life symbol. Okay, I think we're getting close to our first objective. Maybe? <clears throat> Pardon me. I wish I could see.
Okay, we're on negative nine. Oh, what is that? Is that it? No, that's like a beast. So dark. Wait, is my are my headlights on? They are. Dude, yeah, I'm I'm so scared of water. I won't spoil, but playing Outer Wilds really freaked me out. Oh, oh, wait, is this what we're looking for? Maybe? What is this? We got something on the on the picture here. What is this thing? Like a cavern? Have you played Subnautica? Very briefly. That was freaky. Wait, there's a VR Subnautica? Is that good? I might try that, because I haven't played Subnautica much at all. What is all this? These are mines! Oh my god, I hope that flare I sent out didn't doesn't hit anything. Think this might be the direction we need to head. This seems uh, promising. Is the coordinate in the book? Oh damn it! I okay. I don't think those can trigger the uh, the thing. Let me look at the book. Where's the damn book? It, I, it was laying right there. That said die, I saw it, I'm sure, I'm sure of it. Let's just keep going. Maybe it just keeps clipping out of the sub or something. Alright, so I don't think that these mines can be blown up by my thing, so I'm gonna shoot another. I don't know how big my ship is, like, you think I'm getting too close to these mines? Maybe I should go solo. Ooh, I thought that was me triggering a mine. Is it really dark for anyone else? Wait, what do you mean? Is it really dark for you guys? Or or is that just how the game looks? I'm worried. Cause listen, there's this The Sims 3, when you launch that game, it it's dark just on OBS for some reason, but not on the actual game. Okay, yeah, if it looks fine, then good. Thought it was one of those Sims 3 situations. Alright, well, we're in the middle of a damn minefield. Not sure what I'm supposed to be finding out here. I'm gonna try to go swim. Oops, put that away. See any sign of my objective? Anyone? Oh, there's a, uh, there's supposed to be a little, like, sub that you can use. Where's that thing? I think it's attached to the side of this, of the ship they said. Here it is. Cool. All right, let's find our objective. Real bright. Huh. 
who poured all these landmines down here, dude? There's like 400... These are scary. They're giant, too. Maybe I'm just really tiny. Is this how big they are in real life? These things are real, right? I'm not seeing anything. I don't think we're supposed to, I don't think I'm in the right location. I'm gonna go back to the ship. No, because if I hit it, I'm gonna have to start all the way over, and I don't wanna do that. Well, this has been a cool little direction I headed, but I don't think I'm supposed to be here. <sighs> Alright. No! No! Oh my god, please! Shut it! Oh my god, this is bad. This is very bad. What do I do? <laughs> Can I reach this? Oh my god. <laughs> Please. Mm -mm. I can see clearly. I can use this to my advantage. Am I insane or is the inventory face at the bottom left Germa? No. <laughs> You're insane. That's just a, that's like a mask. Alright, I gotta get out of this sticky situation. <clears throat> Can I buy a candy bar from here? Mmm. Oh. I can buy a candy bar. That means I should be able to reach the suit. I just have to find the right... Dang it. <laughs> this one's definitely cool. But I think I'm reaching my... Limit. I'm just too bad. Let's see how many food we can buy. Okay. Oh, you know what? This is making me hungry. Oh. How many little food pieces are in this thing, huh? Try swimming to the surface? You think there is a surface? Let's try it. Oh my god, I can't tell which way's up. Wait, here, I'll do this. Autopilot, up. Okay, cool. I'll autopilot up, and until then, I'll... My food! Where'd my food go? Oh, it's all getting sucked down. Okay, see, guys, this might be where the book keeps disappearing. The book's gone! I'm telling you! I knew I wasn't crazy. Alright, yeah, let's just go up to the surface and then head home, because I don't like it down here. <laughs> he 
<laughs> yeah, the fish are gonna be eating all of my spammo. Or what is it called? Sp yeah, spammo. Mmm. Did you see me do a drive by eat? Ooh. How do I see my depth? What does instant mean? Oh. I wish there were some curtains that I could pull shut uh, over this. This feels like a little bit of an invasion of privacy here. These big eyeballs peering into my sub. Man, I, guys, I can't explain to you how I would just not go into a submarine deep underwater. That is so scary to me. Shut this. I bet I could glitch out of the ceiling like this. Check it. Maybe not. Would you ever stay at those underwater hotels? What is that? Like, is that in pretty shallow water? Is that the one where it's like, you can see the surface? Wait, this, okay, so is this the pressure? The pressure is like subsiding? Dude, so you can get to the surface. Because what happens when you get to zero pressure? Only 20,000 kilometers to go? Hey, that's not bad at all. I think we'll be there in no time. <clears throat> so bars is pressure, you said? So that, we're at... Oh, we will be up there in no time, guys. We just gotta kill a couple minutes. Just hang around, hope I don't press the bomb button over there. We'll be fine. Which is scarier, spaceship or submarine? Uh, for me, I think submarine, to be honest with you. Press the button. Which one? This one? This one, maybe? Yeah, because see, space doesn't have, like, freaking creatures in it. I would be... Dude, to be... Like, I can't explain to you how scared I would be to be in a submarine and to know there's, like, a creature out there. No, I'm pretty sure we wouldn't bump into any weirdness in space. Pretty soon, guys, we'll be able to see the day break. We'll be getting into shallow waters here in, a, in about a little bit. This is, by the way, your captain speaking. Forgot to mention, there's not some stranger on the intercom here. What was that? My boat! Or no, what was that? Oh my god, my gun! Dang it! I can't set things down while I'm going up because it falls through the freaking floor. My boss is gonna fire me. Yeah, I, I travel for 45 minutes to get back to the surface. And he's like, what the hell are you doing up here? You're supposed to be down there looking for these three golden pages or whatever. I, I gotta stop messing with stuff. I have to close this. Come on. I can't shut it. I'm just getting bored, so I'm like messing with things and that's how it's gonna go wrong. What do you think this three means? I should probably eat because there's probably going to be a, an eating mechanic that I actually need to... 
しかかる Come on, please. I don't want to get like close to the surface and then I'm gonna, and then and then not be able to live. Wait! Oh my God, guys, I'm so dumb. I'm so stupid. I'm so dumb. Oh. Ugh. I just forgot I could st stop what I was doing. We're good, we're good. We're fine. I bet I'm gonna get to the surface and break through the water and I'm gonna see the beautiful, maybe, uh, New York skyline. No, guys, I I'm done playing this game. I'm done with this game. I just want to see if you can go to the surface. For some reason, I'm like latching onto this. This is a just chatting stream at this point. Even if it takes hours? Okay, listen, I'm gonna do like I used to do with RuneScape when I was a kid, okay? When I was playing RuneScape as a child, I would always calculate how long it would take me to get my next level by timing how much XP I got and doing the XP an hour, so watch this. Stopwatch, reset. We're gonna see how long it takes to go 25 bars. Timer has started. When it gets to 75, I will stop the timer. Stop. Okay, it took 23 seconds. So just about a bar a second, just about a bar a second, which I, guys, I think I could have deduced that if I just looked at it while it was counting, but that's fine. So now we're gonna do 550 divided by 60, nine minutes. We'll be there in nine minutes. Easy. Hours? Wait. No, you fucking me up, dude. You... <laughs> Nine minutes. Wait, what is this prediction? Is there a surface? Oh, guys, don't be so negative. There's gotta be a surface. <laughs> Obu, thank you, dude. Thanks, everybody. Um, folks, the UI has started to screw up here. Seeing this? Maybe I should sit down in case I glitch through the floor. I want to do this. All right, we're good. Short stream, it's almost two hours. See, that's how it goes, dude. I start streaming and I start having fun. I'm really tired though, I, I, that's why I said short stream. I woke up at 9 a.m. Probably the earliest out of any per human on the planet, but uh... 
yeah, since then I've just been tired. Seven minute power nap? No, no, guys, I can make it to the surface. Well, I'll, maybe I'll sleep when I get to the surface. Let's see how the prediction's doing. Seventy-five percent of you think seventy-four think there's not going to be a surface. You guys are going to be so humiliated here in just a moment. Streamer schedules are just how I was when I was a teenager. No, dude, listen, don't get it twisted. Because on a normal day, I wake up at ten a.m. I've fixed my my sleep schedule a lot. I used to wake up at like one. But then I corrected it. I put all my money in the bet that there's not a surface. Oh, well, I'm sorry for your loss. Sorry for your big fat L, but we're going to be getting up there and I'm going to drink a cocktail on the beach with some smoking hot babes. Multiple of them. And I'm going to play beach volleyball, but I'm going to pronounce it volleyball. And they're all going to giggle and think I'm cute because I didn't know that it's actually volleyball. I thought it was volleyball when I was a kid. I'm not going to lie. DOA XBVB is genuinely a good volleyball game. Okay, I don't know what that is, but is that similar to that one volleyball game that's got like big asses and boobs everywhere? Cause listen, I'm sure I'm sure it's a fine game, but dude. <laughs> oh that that's dead or alive, is that what it's called? I remember seeing like the cover of one of those games one time and being like <laughs> No, that's like a that's being like what the fuck? No, 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 that's being like Oh, shut up. No, it's not anything like that. that. That's like a concerned what the fuck. Oh, whatever. Whatever. How many bars are we at? We're at 222. Why, why can't I look around anymore? Oh, I, I'm in the seat. Oh my god, you guys are making me so embarrassed. I need to be more clear and concise with my words instead of just assuming you know what I'm talking about. I should probably eat. Don't want to starve. All right, up we go more. Wait, how what's my oxygen? I don't know what they are. You guys are seeing the vibrations, right? I think this sub's gonna be tearing itself apart the farther we get from the uh, origin of the game. <laughs> what if what if I get to the surface and I keep going up? Like I break the surface and there's like a beautiful landscape and I just keep floating up into space. Maybe the sub will explode. Dude, I'm kind of worried that just out of nowhere some loud sound's gonna happen and it's gonna say that I die. And it's gonna really scare me. Wait, can you guys hear me over the sound of the sub ambient noises? 
I just, cause last night, okay, last night playing Lethal Company, I watched back some of those clips and I, my audio levels were not balanced correctly. Also had like eight people. Well, no, I mean like uh, like the game volume was too loud. Like every, like, well, I'm too tired to think. Just pretend I made sense there. Hundred bars left. Oh, dude, yes, we're sub eighty bar. Well, sub hundred bars. Guys, we are about to get to the freaking surface. Let's see how much pressure we've got. That is pressure, right? Someone said. <laughs> Honolulu, here we come. Almost to 50 bars. 50 bars! How do you know zero bars is the surface? Um, I don't. Someone just said, someone said something about bars being pressure, so I assumed when it gets to zero, that would be that, that there's no more pressure which would be surface. Well, actually guys, I think all of humanity is sort of under some pressure at, at any given point in time. So maybe if we get to the surface, the, it'll still read like one or two bar. Zero is space? Oh, huh? Wait, so we're about to be a space? 10 bars till space? Uh, all right, here comes the surface. Uh, it's dark out. <laughs> it's dark out tonight. Well, listen, listen, don't get too... Uh, look, see, we still have 81,000 pressure or whatever this is. Let's wait till this gets to zero and then we'll determine... We'll pay out the bet, okay? Because there still could be a surface. <laughs> there still could be one. Let's just get... Let's run this down. Go outside. No, it looks still pretty wet and, like, deadly out there. See, look, this is like a depth meter, but how do I display my depth? You know, let me put this... Oh, that module's gone. I don't know what so much of this does. Oh, it's <laughs> oh, oh, wait. What? New bar dropped. <laughs> New bar just dropped. Guys, apparently 1104 is what we're at, maybe. How did I update this? How did I make this update? Bar is atmospheric pressure, so one bar is a pressure of all the air at water level. Okay, so now, now scientist, what does negative 107 mean? So glad I came <laughs> in just in time to hear Charborg's famous catchphrase, Charbo Cheer. Major Shazma, thank you. Oh no. Alright, let's just let this run down. Let's do the math on this. How much does it take for 1,000 to go by? It's going to take three minutes. Okay. Wait, three seconds per thousand. So th 60 times three is 120 plus 60, 180, uh, 180 seconds, three minutes. <clears throat> Wait, yeah, we're good. Take another seat for a little bit. Just enjoy the beautiful view. 180 minutes? No, 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 no. Seconds. Wait. 180. Oh, God. See, there, uh, less than, it'll be less than... It'll be longer than a minute and less than an hour. So somewhere in between there. 
Thank you, Bruno. Three times 60 is 120 plus 60 equals 0 0.006 days. Okay, we gotta get someone to do the calculations on that. 0 0.006 days is 1% of a day would be, what's 24, what's 100 divided by 24? 24 divided by 100, I mean. Well, gosh, that's gotta be 2.4. 2.4. So what's 2.4 divided by 100? 0.24? 0 0.024. What's 0 0.024 times... <laughs> I don't know. 0 Guys, I don't think there's going to be a surface. I'm, I mean, we're still going to run this down, but I'm starting to really doubt. <clears throat> it's just not seeming likely. I'm supposed to join them for the Amish challenge. Every, like, every, all my friends are playing that... WoW Amish challenge, and I have no idea how to play WoW. It's permadeath, so I, uh, I'm kind of worried that I'm gonna immediately die to some, like, hog. <laughs> At, like, level one, one and a half. I mean, I've played a lot of World of Warcraft, but I don't know anything about, like, classic WoW. Yeah, I gotta pick something like a, like a tank. They're level five at the moment. They're gonna be doing it for days. I'm not worried about being behind. And plus, I'm not gonna join for the whole thing. They were talking about, they were like, uh, oh yeah, guys, raids are only like 10 people. So it's gonna be real awkward when we're trying to like do raids. And I'm like thinking in my head, I am not, I'm gonna get to level five and quit. <clears throat> that does not concern me. Okay, we're about to be there. Here it comes, folks, the surface. Everybody ready? I think I already see some light. This is so exciting for us, for all the believers, all like 12 of us. Save me a spot at the beach bar. <laughs> oh, you've got it, brother. I'm dying. 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 Oh. I suffocated. That was the oxygen pressure? Wait! Wait! That was my oxygen level? You're telling me that was my oxygen level? What is- what, what was the- what was the uh, thing? MPA? MPA? Uh... Stands for what? Masters of Public Administration. All right, pay him out. <laughs> There's no service, no surface. All right, this one was cool. Yeah, that one was really cool. 
<clears throat> I'm just, uh, I didn't get to see any of the, uh, items that you're supposed to be hunting for, but you know what? I have my own fun, my own bit of fun. Alright, let me see if there's any others I want to try. Dude, I want to play, um, my summer car soon. I was thinking about how much fun it was playing that, that game called Neat. That, th th okay, I know I've said this like 40 times, but I want to keep saying it because people are getting here and they don't know what I'm talking about. But I was playing games from the dev who made Neat because I loved Neat so much. Like, I can't, I can't explain how much fun a game like that is mods for it are hilarious um wait there are my summer car mods maybe i'll look into that yeah i i definitely want to do my summer car before long but i'm gonna save that for a day when i have energy and like all day to play because that game is, there's a lot to it. Show bolt sizes. Oh my God, there's some quality of life mods that I'm definitely getting. I'm looking right now. Where can you find this neat game? It's called N-E-E-T. I'll, I'll link it. It's actually on Steam also. Isn't it? Yeah, there's a demo on Steam. God, it was so much fun, dude. I just... I love games that just have... super complex systems for no reason. Like... <laughs> Here it is. Ready to watch you play some weird games at Sea Harbor. I'm Graham. Thank you, dude. Thanks for the resub. Honestly, I might be done for the night or the day, dude. It's still so early in the day. Yeah, I might just go chill and see you guys tomorrow. It was fun though. Thanks for hanging out, guys. I guess I should swap to this this screen. Let me tell you guys what I've been interested in lately. Here's some upcoming stuff that I want to do. Um, uh, My Summer Car, Mon Bazoo, and uh, those two are just because I had so much fun playing that neat game. Then I want to play Teardown at some point because I think that'd be fun to do something in. Stalker, Tower Unite. I was watching, uh, I was watching Chief the other night stream Tower Unite. And he was just walk, walking around like his viewers were joining and just being weird. And that looks like a lot of fun. So I definitely want to do that. Uh, more Urge. Want to do Urge? Will you return to the last RimWorld save? Yeah, absolutely. I want to play more RimWorld too. And uh, all this is just sort of while I'm working on the next project that I have. And guys... Huge progress has been made. I, uh, I figured something out that was <laughs> driving me crazy. And I, for days, I couldn't figure out what I was doing wrong. And then today I had a breakthrough and figured out how to fix this issue. So the next, like, goofy little thing that I have planned will be before too long. Can you share the RimWorld mod pack? Yeah, I need to... I need to figure out how to do that. I'll probably make a... I need to make like a page on my website that links to all my mod packs for different games.
Yeah, I, I need to make a... Dude, I just hate Steam's... Oh, God, I hate... I complain about it every time I think about it, but Steam's, like, collection system is so garbage. They need to revamp it. It's so bad. Maybe one day. My collections are public. I have a bunch of random collections. I just make a new one <laughs> anytime I have to do some shit. This is the Void got a new update. I'll probably play that at some point. Maybe we can let you guys call in. I've been liking doing the text-to-speech where it just reads random chat messages, so maybe we'll try that. I don't know. I'll think on it. Helltaker? Is that on Steam? My winter car? Wait, what? Are you fucking with me? What What would... Huh. I will look into this. Ugh. Seeing you play Stalker is going to be great. Oh, dude, I love Stalker. I need to play it more. I uh, I had so much fun with the little bit that I've played of Stalker. Did you try Gamma? I don't remember what I played. I have some mod thing that I... Let me try to search my computer and find that really quick. Let's see. It is... I have no idea what I played. Anomaly? Stalker Anomaly? Is Gamma a mod for a not? I Stalker Anomaly is the one that just combines all three of the Stalker games, right? Or some I don't know. Gamma is a mod pack for Anomaly. Okay, cool. Then I'll pr I'll probably try that. That'd be fun. I don't know what it adds or anything, but I'll look into it, definitely. Yeah, I don't know if you can play My Summer Car with a wheel, but I definitely should if you can. Oh, and Observation Duty, yeah. I, I should revisit that game. I I've only played like two of them, and there's like eight or something. Ugh, I'm so tired. It's pretty hardcore though. I like that though. I, I, I know I'm bad at games usually, but I, I do enjoy that. Because I like, I don't know, the story that comes from difficulty. What do you guys want to do tomorrow? Maybe my summer car tomorrow. Relevant clip. Oh, I just love being fucked. Why did I say that? Like, oh, it's just nothing beats it, dude. Why did I say that? How is that relevant to anything? Oh, I'm talking about, oh my god, I'm talking about, okay. I'm talking about games being hard and being in situations where I'm fucked. <laughs> Dude, no, it's so true. I love, I love for it to be just way harder than I can handle. Not that it's, not to be unfair, but to be just difficult. It's so fun. 
It's just funny. I love overcoming a challenge. No, shut up. Shut up. <laughs> When's the next court session? You know, we should. We should uh, do a clip thing again sometime. Because I'm sure there's a lot since the last time. <laughs> I'll have to look and see. Uh... We'll have to like have a way to organize all the clips. Shadows of Doubt got an update? Yeah, I forgot about that. I need to revisit that. Let's see, I'll add that to the list of things I want to play. Shadows of Doubt. What, what, what were we just talking about, too? Oh, there was one I was just talking about. What about the viewer fish game? No, unfortunately, with that sorting chat by Toxicity, I, I mentioned this a bit, but... I know not everybody knows. It's it it really encouraged people to just be annoying as fuck in my chat for for a very long. It still happens. That ruined my chat for a very long time. Yeah, because like despite me explaining in the video that uh, I don't know. I guess I just should have. Yeah, I should have like seen it coming. But uh. Turns out when you tell people that you're jokingly sorting their message history by who was toxic and crazy and weird and all that, that encourages that behavior because people come in and be like, oh, I want to be on the next one. Just completely didn't even consider that. I mean, saying it out loud, it's like obviously that was going to happen, but yeah, that ruined chat for a very long time. <laughs> so I can't can't do any more of that but there's plenty of fun stuff i have planned like this thing that's coming up here before too long that i've been working on is going to be really cool reminds me of when Lug ludwig ludwig made segments of the stream to review ban lift appeals how did that go because i i do remember seeing people do that a lot and that seems like it would encourage a weird sort of behavior I don't know though, because I could see like being so open with moderation as like a way to just show people what's not allowed, you know? How would you make an algorithm to search for niceness? Pro the same way that that this uh, toxicity one, it like sorted by obscene words and like violent words and like cuss words. No, personally, I don't want to do ban appeals on stream, dude. People are... I don't know. I don't think I would ever do that. <laughs> It'd be different if we were, like, jokingly, like, throwing bans out, like, no big deal. But the people we ban are just kind of, like, weird. <laughs> Dude, there's this person, I, I I don't know if I talked about this, there's a person who has been commenting on like every YouTube video that's like, by the way, the mods banned me for uh, coming up with a nickname for Charborg and calling him Charbabe. They banned me for that. Isn't that so weird? Isn't that so weird? They comment this on every video. I went and looked up their comment history, guys, and it was like spamming for so long like char babe will you marry me char babe can you uh can you kiss me on the forehead char babe blah 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 and then like mods time them out and then they come immediately back afterward char babe i just got timed out can, will you kiss me like stuff like that and it's like dude what do you mean <laughs> so in his mind he's twisting it like oh yeah i give charbrook a nickname and i got banned for it isn't that so cringe No, you were being weird. Okay, guys, I'm gonna go. I'll see you tomorrow, maybe for my summer car. And I will keep chugging away, working on... Dude, I've been trying to get it set up. This has been so helpful. I've been trying to get it to where... 
I do like all the YouTube stuff that I have to do for the week, like all at once, just like knock it out. And then the entire rest of the week, just like do stream prep and fun stuff. And that's been super helpful because what ended up happening was like every day I would do a little bit of the YouTube work, like do a little bit here and then try to stream. And then I was not getting anything done efficiently. So this will hopefully, I think things are going to be looking up. All right, let's raid. Hmm. Hmm. Bucklington. <laughs> that buy emote makes me so sad, dude. It feels like it's ending on such a sad note. Oh, that's not showing up on stream either. Is that because it's 7TV? Yeah, it is. Something's going on with the widget in 7TV. I'll figure that out at some point. All right, guys. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for all the subs and the bits. Much appreciated. See you tomorrow.